YouTube, you already know who it is. It's Laquana, and I'm back again with another reaction video. In this reaction video, you can see a man that's at the gym, and he's with his wife, and he catches somebody recording his wife. <sighs> no, no. <laughs> I mean, the way how the man was recording secretly recording the other man's wife knowing that she might have her husband there like the first time when i seen this video i was like why is that man staring at him so crazy like he was staring at him for like a good minute or something and then that kind of think of it i said hmm, that might be not her personal trainer that might be is her personal trainer slash husband yeah that's what result of that being like i was like is he seriously sitting up videotaping a man and his wife? Like, well, he was videotaping the lady's butt. And I really didn't like that. I'm like, I would, if I was the dude who was recording, I would be aware of my surroundings. Like, he knew it was disrespectful. Like, that's why he stopped recording. And then at the end, he just pretended like he was making a phone call. Like. That man was about to really attack you. you. He was going to put that dude in the hospital for a couple of weeks. Like, that's how mad and angry he was. But to tell you the truth, it was just crazy. Like, he was just sitting there thinking that was cool, videotaping, videotaping somebody else's wife. Normally, she not by herself. Like, I would have known right off the bat that was her husband in the first place. Like, it really didn't make no sense to me. Like... Especially if you don't know the lady and then it's like this man could have physically harmed you over his wife Like you got to be more careful about stuff like that Like I don't want nobody videotaping me especially without my consent Like he was really just videotaping a lady like is you serious and then it's like Somebody else was recording him recording her like I mean that man, that man could have easily killed them, whoever he was with. Like, I ain't gonna tell you no lie. Like, that's why I really don't go to gyms and stuff like that. And, like, Planet Fitness, I guarantee you there was, like, Planet Fitness or something like that. And he was just recording when she was on a treadmill. And her booty was moving around. And he liked what he seen, started recording it so he could watch it later. I'm like, no, that's not right. Like, you videotaping somebody else's wife. Like, that's disrespectful and out of line, out of pocket. It's all of the above. And then he was trying to, it's like, man, quit looking at me. And the man was still staring at him. Like, if I was that man, I probably would have ended up in jail. <laughs> For real. Because I, I guarantee you, he probably would never look at that lady again. <laughs> He probably would never look at her again. <laughs> and, I, and that's just crazy. Like, I just, like, I don't see nothing funny about that. But I guarantee you, he um, if he ever see that man, like, at a grocery store or the mall, he gonna shoot past the other way. I ain't gonna lie to you. But it is what it is. Like, I seen this video, like, bro. A couple of months ago, and then I come across it, like, last week, and I was like, hmm, should I do a report about this? And it's kind of interesting. <laughs> it was interesting, because I was like, when the first time I seen this video, I'm like, is he really serious videotaping somebody else's wife? And while her husband watching him? He asking for it. He asking for a death wish. But... As y'all can see at the end of the video, he just got up and walked away and that was the end of that. Like, like stuff like that, it just, it don't make no sense. Like, for real, it really don't make no sense. And, like, he itty-bitty, he's skinny, and a man is built. <laughs> he was gonna go to He was gonna be up in the hospital. See, like, the thing is, I don't condone domestic violence, but over a wife people don't play about their wives especially built men i i mean obviously he had to be scared for his life i mean he could have called him at the parking lot or the bathroom in the shower like 
It really didn't matter to him. He was really like the see the thing is the way I think I saw it is like the muscular man, he was just eyeballing him like you know what I could physically do to you while you videotaping my wife? Like it really didn't make no sense. Like now like, I wouldn't want nobody videotaping me, so I really don't go out on to public places anywhere so i just stay home with my baby and take care of my child and the only time when i do leave if it's for me or for her and her dad so um it is what it is i ain't gonna say no lie but it just i just didn't like that fact like when i first seen this video i was like it's what the world is he doing and i looked closely into his phone the lady he recording a lady. I said, this man is asking for it. <laughs> this man is really asking for it. Like, it just really didn't make no sense to me. I just, like, no, like, no. Like, because it's like, for one, the lady is not going to be in a, per like, public, I mean, pl what is it called? She not going to be at Planet Fitness by herself and self for a trainer. Like, I figure some ladies, especially black ladies, they always have their husbands be their personal trainer so they won't have to go and spend a large amount of money for a professional personal trainer. And to be honest with you, like, if my boyfriend was built and stuff like that, like, if my boyfriend liked to work out, like, I would work under him. Like, I wouldn't pay no money to um, sit him while he could do it for free. I mean, just like how he just got me a a treadmill downstairs. I don't gotta go nowhere. Like, I mean, for my exercising, me and my mother-in-law used to just walk around the block. Like, that's what my exercising was until he bought me the treadmill and now my treadmill needs some work on and that's how I really do my um exercise. Get on the treadmill for like 30 minutes. By the time the 30 minutes is up, like the 30 minutes just go by that quick, especially on treadmill. It's like sometimes I run on it, sometimes I walk and I do it for like 30 minutes. Like I take a break, like a one minute break at the 15 minute mark and then I get the other 15. Sometimes I did it for an hour. And when I did it for an hour, when I did it for an hour, my legs was sore. So, I tried to limit it like 30 to 35 minutes per day. And I was on it until it started messing up. So, my boyfriend is going to fix it for me so I could get back on track with my treadmill. So, that was the end of result of why I don't go to any planet fitnesses and places and stuff like that especially like gyms like I don't like I don't feel comfortable especially with the with the body I got I don't feel comfortable working out in front of people because you don't like they you could be the only female and it could be like 20 men in there and they'll all try to holler at you I really don't have time for that <laughs> so I'm glad that my boyfriend brought me a treadmill and I'm pretty thankful for him for doing stuff like that for me because he know I need to lose weight I mean he's not the type to judge me on gaining weight I did have gained a little bit of weight like I was skinny like I had to been 115 pounds when I graduated high school but I graduated high school six years ago so I mean time flies I was 19 and skinny and I mean pretty much like and like I lost like I was pretty much a little big like before I graduated I was kind of like this size but I had lost it like as soon as my dad bought me a car I was not home all the time. I was gone, like, pretty much every day, all day. And the only time when I'm coming home, the only time when I'm coming home is I go to sleep or I do my chores before I leave. So, and I really didn't have no appetite. I really had to just force myself to eat. But I really lost, like, over 40 pounds, like, after when I graduated high school. Like, I was skinny. I was wearing crop tops and all. Like, everybody was like... Oh my God, you look so better now. Like you lost all this weight. You were skinny. Like my clothes was just like, especially in pant sizes. If I could be a little more specific, I was wearing like zero to three size and booty shorts and pants. So right now I'm a sixteen. So that's a big. That's when I had my baby. I had a group and.
to be honest with you, I'm, I'm going to lose this weight, but I'm not going to starve myself like I did the first time. Because really, I really didn't have an appetite when I had first had got my car. Like, I was gone. Like, from the time I wake up and from the time, like, I get home, like, 1 o'clock in, in the morning. Like, I was just with my ex-boyfriend pretty much every day. Like, but, like, well, to be honest with you, some days I stay home do my chores eat then i leave like about leave to go to his house by like five o'clock or something like that in the evening and then leave like one o'clock in the morning and all we used to do was just jump in the pool and had people with us we all used to get in the pool and stuff like that and have fun and we did our special well not special but the only thing what we really used to do is go to statesboro and go to walmart the 24 hour Walmart at night <laughs> i really miss doing it i really miss going to walmart at night i wish they had it to where they could just open back up because it's really that's when i really do my shopping like that's how i used to go to sh like after when i was working at clutch and poetry before i got sick like every friday like before we get paid we'll go to walmart me and my my god brother will just go to walmart right after work and stay in walmart for like two hours just looking at stuff and if we really need it we'll buy it and stuff like that and that's what we used to do every friday as soon as we get cash our checks then we gone and that was just the end of that so um this is this is all and uh, really didn't do nothing all week um still getting over the cold and I feel a little bit i feel a little bit better my boyfriend he feels a little bit better like he been catching headaches around like at night it just don't make no sense like it don't make no sense but that is it that's just the review of this week so if you are new please like this video please subscribe and share and turn on the post notification bell button so you'll be notified every time when i make posts upload and upload a post and share a post and in the meantime i will see you next time